Hello everyone, Darren here, and on today's episode of WotC Academy, we're going to look at a brand new mode in World of Tanks Modern Armor, and that is going to be the Control Mode. Now, right off the bat, I want to mention that this mode is currently in its beta form. It makes that very clear in the menu when you first log into the game that the mode is in beta form. And uh, everything I'm about to explain in this video is, of course, subject to change later down the line if there are multiple iterations of this game mode. Now, um, I am going to have a, uh, a quick image pop up here of what you're going to see when you first click into the mode. Um, and, uh, of course, what you're going to see when you do load in is it's going to have the event mode uh, description right there of what the objectives are. It's going to have the team size. Uh, it's going to have the time limit. The uh, respawn uh, will let you know if it's activated or deactivated. Um, the tier range, so we do know that potentially it could be tiers like 6 through 8, or 8 through 10, or 3 through 5, or, or something like that. Um, and then it can it tells you also the tank type, so of course, um, Artie is uh, excluded from this mode, and I'll get into more details about this mode in a couple minutes. Uh, it also tells you what nations are allowed, um, and of course, what maps are supported in this mode course and then you can continue on and uh, your garage is going to be automatically selected to compatible vehicles or locked to that specific tier now uh, I would like to point out some key details uh, regarding the um, this mode and what makes it different from uh, a regular pub game now bear with me I'm gonna have uh, a little pop-up that you normally see on some of my how to play videos uh, and these are gonna be very uh, summed up uh, minimalistic uh, bullet points here so uh, make sure you're listening um, so in this format it's going to be a 7v7 instead of 15v15 uh, the mode uh, time limit is going to be 10 minutes um, you will get points for kills and capturing bases. Um, the first team to 1,000 points is going to win the game. Um, there are infinite respawns. Like I said, uh, the respawns are activated, so you can respawn multiple times. Um, you can earn XP and silver, but it's going to be at a reduced rate. And it's you know, So think co-op mode on how that's lower earnings than pubs. Um, and then, uh, of course, there's not going to be any medals. Um, this mode does not count towards stats. Uh, and it does not count towards challenges or ops. Uh, platoons are allowed in this mode. Um, there, currently, right now, no arty is allowed in this mode. Of course, that could be subject to change. We don't know. Uh, and right now, it is tier 8 only. Again, it is in beta form. So... Everything that I have explained uh, about this mode is subject to change, and uh, this video will be updated accordingly once uh, the next mode comes out, or the next, sorry, next iteration of this mode comes out, or the mode is finalized. But that's pretty much it, really, regarding this mode. Um, in summary, uh, I would think of this mode like the tanks version of Call of Duty's Domination or Battlefield's Conquest mode, where... Um, there's multiple bases you capture the bases you capture the bases that the enemy team has and you just kill and um capture bases to earn points and the team that excuse me reaches uh the um the goal of a thousand points is going to win the game so um yeah really it's kind of world of tanks's take on that mode but um, that's going to do it for today's video. I'd like to thank you all for watching. Um, hopefully you have uh, noticed in this, uh, this replay here um, the various uh, cool little features regarding this mode, such as the respawns and um, uh, the, the capturing the bases, the point tickets, um, and, you know, how that works in sync. And, of course, hopefully you can forgive the fact that my controller is now showing signs of stick drift and I am not as accurate as I used to be, as apparently it's very severe. Um, but, yeah, I'd like to thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed this video, hit that thumbs up. And if you want to see more videos like this one, don't forget to subscribe. But until next time, this has been Darren.
of Watch the Academy.